Hello and welcome guys, this is a quick tutorial so that you can, yeah, uh, you know, use uh, the shrink wrap tool in a better way. So the common mistakes we make is, uh, like, you can see this thing, I just re-topologize this, right? So uh, also there's this region inside which is also, you know, part of the topology, right? So when we, you know, let's just say I apply this mirror modifier to this and use the shrink okay let me just use multi-resolution first now i'm gonna apply the shrink crab modifier uh, and just select this sculpted mesh as a base so you're gonna notice that this whole thing is actually being destroyed the top one is destroyed it's gonna you know be getting worse when we move you know into much higher subdivision so uh, and we won't even notice this so an easy fix for this is go to edit mode and uh, select this vertex group i've already assigned this but you can do it manually just by you know selecting any group and then plus sign and then assign and when you just do this you're gonna have this right so yeah i uh, i did the same right so this is the unused which is this region which is not going to be shrink wrapped and this is the use which is simply control i of this you know the unused one so uh, what i'm going to do is going to modify tab and then vertex group and we're going to press used and that's gonna just cancel this region from being shrink, shrink wrapped as you can see and in the end I'll get a better topology I would say yeah and now I can you know easily sculpt even in the higher you know subdivision area now so yeah this was it for this video guys I hope you enjoy this short tutorial and yeah thanks for watching cheers